Yo what's going on guys and welcome to a brand new video here on my channel and my main goal for this video is now to show everyone how to do a simple highlight intro which is completely understandable for everyone, everyone can pull this off and this video is like an all in one, you got literally everything, every single piece of information you need to know to make a really nice and crispy intro in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch the entire video, I'm gonna explain you exactly what to do and yeah, we are here right now in Adobe Premiere Pro 2020 and first of all you need to get some cinematics. Don't be worried, I got you covered. In the description there's a pack with some free cinematics for your intro, but there's like plenty on the on YouTube, like people creating these and yeah, making them public for people to use them, you know. And yeah, just get yourself some cinematics. So and after you basically got all your cinematics here ready, for me it's three main sequences I'm going to use and they look really crispy and nice and basically all you need to do now is press T on your keyboard and click somewhere on the timeline and in the video where you want to have your font. So let's say as an intro you want to have highlight highlight video 1. I'm sorry that voice I'm a little bit tired. Highlight video 1 and all you need to do now then is to change the text font to whatever text font you want to have. For me it's Magic Dreams, I think it looks really good. And then you have to center the text and make it a little bit bigger here. So this might work. So and now you see this text font and you ask yourself, a lot of YouTubers have these wavy text fonts. How can I do that myself? All you need to do is head over to the effects tab and look for tur turbulent displays. Then you drag this effect over onto your font, text font. And don't be worried, this is not how it's going to look. You ha have to make sure you selected your text font and then you go on the effects control panel. And now you see here your effect, turbulent in this place and put the amount on five. Trust me guys, five is godlike for this here. And then just make sure you go all the way to the left side here on this graph, I don't know how to call it. And press by evolution on the little timestamp here and then drag it all the way to the right side basically where your font is about to end and make sure to go on 10 times x that's basically what you want to do you can rather do it with the slider here or just type it in there 10x and now as you can see the text font is like moving and when we now get the video here you can you can define this by yourself if you want more to be like more shaky or not can basically do it all by yourself and this is maybe not the best text font for this kind of videos but yeah it, it gets the job done I guess and if you found your text font and you wanna basically continue this type here just make sure to hold alt on your keyboard and drag this one over to the right side and you can readjust it here and now if you go over on the timeline you can just simply change the text here um, huge shout out to Ninja, I don't know, <laughs> just a little bit, make it a little bit smaller, that's maybe too big of a text there, but you get the point, and as you can see now, after this highlight session is continued, now you can see the effect will just continue, and you can proceed to put whatever you want in here, maybe your Twitter, your Instagram, your YouTube, I don't know, this is basically how to make this intro, and it's really, really easy, guys, it's really, really easy. And yeah, you can use whatever text font, obviously. You can also put a bunch of GIFs in there or some extra rendered videos, like these extra rendered Twitter um, GIFs, you know, whatever. And after that, just make sure to go again on Project Untitled and drag your music over and yeah, you're basically good to go. This is how it's made. It's not that hard, guys. Everyone can pull this off. And if this tutorial helped you in any form, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Um, yeah. I wish you all guys the best, have a great day, and until next time, yeah, peace.